Today, 19th of October, 1997, in St. Peter's Square, filled with faithful from every part of the world, and in the presence of a great many cardinals, archbishops and bishops, during this solemn Eucharistic celebration, I proclaimed the race of the child Jesus and the holy face, a doctor of the universal church, in these words, fulfilling the wishes of many brothers in the episcopate and of a great number of faithful throughout the world, after consulting the congregation for the causes of saints and hearing the opinion of the congregation for the doctrine of the faith regarding her eminent doctrine with certain knowledge and after lengthy reflection with the fullness of our apostolic authority, we declare Saint Therese of the Child Jesus and the Holy Face, Virgin, to be a doctor of the Universal Church in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. We read this from the apostolic letter of His Holiness, Saint and Pope, John Paul II. Divini Amoris Scientia. Once the Lord asked me through a bishop in a dream, Can you prepare a thesis about unity through dexterity? Though I heard the word dexterity for the first time, my soul understood the meaning skill and dexterity in French. I asked. Dear Bishop, is it not through Trinity we have our unity? Yes, he replied and continued, but who understands Trinity in a proper way? As meditating about this so deeply, the year of first centenary of the canonization of St. Teresa of Lisieux approached and I prepared myself too deeply. Apostolic exhortation, sila confiance of the Holy Father Francis on confidence in the merciful love of God for the 150th anniversary of the birth of Saint Therese of the Child Jesus and the Holy Face was promulgated. Sila confiance, Ayrin Kuhlak confiance, Kyudanu Kondur Ahlak Moor. We have this quotation from St. Therese of the Child Jesus and the Holy Face from her letter 197 to Sister Mary of the Sacred Heart, 17th September 1896. As I was meditating, the sayings of St. Therese of Lisieux, I came across her words, It's love I ask for, love is all the skill I need. I noticed this first as a quoting from St. Therese of Lisieux, quoted in the book, A Retreat with Therese of Lisieux by Elizabeth Ruth Obad Odyssey. Let us listen to her same idea directly from Story of a Soul, the autobiography of St. Teresa of Lisieux, translation by John Clark. I understand so very well that it is only through love that we can render ourselves pleasing to the good Lord, that love is the one thing I long for. The science of love is the only science I desire. I also noticed from her letter my dear Celine, think of a beautiful peach with its delicate tint of rose, with its flavor so sweet that no human skill could invent such nectar. From the story of a soul, the autobiography of Saint Therese of Lisieux. Epilogue number 16, Victim of Love. Jesus unites his love and suffering to our love and suffering and produces the fragrance of love and suffering to save souls. Let us offer them up in this year of prayer, 
coinciding with the first centenary of canonization of St. Therese of Lisieux. Let us have this confidence when we love, united with Christ, Church and Saints, our sufferings and love, unite and its fragrant cycles through heaven and earth. Amen. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you through the immaculate heart of Mother Mary, the first tabernacle. Amen.